Like the video where I'll make a clone of your waifu, but this version of her will... Will... Well, she won't really be that different. She'll be as trash as the original. But now she'll have a different name. So, yeah. Part 2. Verdant Wind. Pegasus Moon. Valley of Torment. You remember that one chapter in Radiant Dawn? The one chapter where you're fighting in a volcano? with these spaces whose only purpose is to tell you, Hey, don't stand there, it's gonna hurt! Remember how it was composed of a scarce amount of unimpressive enemies and an equally unimpressive boss, making the journey kind of a slog? This is that. This chapter is that chapter. Except the volcano doesn't launch pinpoint mortar strikes made of lava rock. It just kinda and sizzle a unit like they're making goddamn hamburger helper. This level is trash. The lava tiles are in garbage locations meant to slow you down, but it's like, oh, just beat enemies here. Like how you've been doing so much already throughout this game. They even have a time sensitive event of saving Judith when she spawns that you need to trek through the largest collection of lava tiles. Oh no, I must kill eight units in six turns to save milk from three horses. Lava doesn't even kill, what do I do? Did you guys know you got a whole ass energy drop for talking to Judith with Claude? Like, what? Huh? Okay, I guess. Sure, why not? Heh, <laughs> we are in the ultimate sniping location. It is impossible for them to reach us. Yeah, yeah, it's impossible. We will rain down a volley of arrows of which Foden has never yeah, seen before. Yeah, they get it. Now is the time for our ultimate glory. We, we gonna will go be down famous. in history as the greatest heroes in all of the empire. Huh? Where are they going? Come on, let's follow them. Uh, but what about the ultimate sniping location? Forget that, you fool. Okay. Come this way. D what? Huh? Hello? D it, it, do the AI work? This isn't even a solid wall. You can just fly your ass over it. Like, I, I don't get it. None of the design elements make any sense. All the AI are stupid idiots. The map is built poorly around a bad gimmick with bad enemy placements. It just becomes a boring stroll to the finish. At least, you can skip over all of it because this boss is equally as trash. He has a shield that prevents effective damage against cavalry units, but he forgot to remember that he's also an armored unit, so you can just bonk him with a hammer and it's all good. He gets doubled by Raphael. Nobody gets doubled by Raphael. Like, what are we even doing here? It's, uh, 3 out of 10. I, I don't even know why it's not a 2. Maybe because it's just boring and not offensively bad like chapter five or anything wait hold on i forgot ambush reinforcements two out of ten fuck you